Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Escapist Science and Technology Podcast. I'm your host, CJ, and joining me... I didn't say my last... It, it, <laughs> what happened was I was on the... Uh, I was on the Tabletop Podcast, and they just introduced me as CJ, and then it kind of became an, a, a recurring joke throughout that I don't have a last name, and like one of the Cher. other guys... Yeah, that's, that's that's exactly what I said. Like, I don't have a last name. I'm like, Cher. And then someone else said, or like, Sting. And I'm like, yeah, why don't I say that? Like, why don't I pick the girl? Because <laughs> Cher is cooler. <laughs> uh, all right. <laughs> Take two. God damn it, you better keep this in. Don't you dare cut this out. <laughs> God damn you, CJ. I'm going to refer to you as Cher for the entire rest of the podcast, so you absolutely have to be Like, you don't have a choice. <laughs> well, most people don't know what the C stands for anyway, so... <laughs> yeah, I know what it stands for, Cher. I thought it was Sting. <laughs> Does the J stand for sting? <laughs> yeah, it's great. a silent J. Yeah. Oh, that's. I mean, that makes sense. <laughs> All right, then let's keep rolling. All right, so <laughs> joining me on the panel this week, we have escapist writers Marlo Desat, Josh Angan, and Marshall Lemon. Thanks for joining us. Thanks. Hello. Hello. All right, we're gonna dive right into some sci and tech headlines, and hopefully nothing that involves nomenclature. And just to clarify, this this computer's covering or managing all nukes for the United States, like all of them, like every silo, every storage facility. It's just. Are you fighting a cat? <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> yeah, my <laughs> my my cat likes to 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 try to drink from my cup or anything that I'm drinking. She gets jealous. But uh, yeah, that's a good question, Marshall. I'm I'm really not sure about that. I think it's it's relegated to the United States, uh, but it, it will probably be everything. <laughs> this is going this, very well. This is way more entertaining than talking about nuclear weapons. <laughs> <laughs> the new supercomputer has the storage capacity of 57, just shy of 57 billion floppies. Okay, good. <laughs> That's what I needed to know. You would probably need more room to store these floppies than you would to store the nuclear weapons that they're keeping. <laughs> and in fact, if you drop the floppies on a country, you'll probably do more damage than the nuclear weapon. <laughs> and just to clarify one thing for anyone who might be saying, what's so special about this headline? You know, people grow pot indoors all the time, or, you know, the concept of hydroponics has existed in sci-fi for the longest time. This is more about the efficiency that he's worked out a system or they've worked out this system where it's it's so much more efficient I guess than what we've historically known about I like that you did a shout out to just the potheads just then <laughs> <Not after the potheads. laughs> know about plants I think there might actually be a level above top secret I'm not sure though easy there cat let me talk to your cat CJ we want its opinion on foreign policy <laughs> I don't know if you can hear the purring, probably not. I can't. Hey, Cat, <laughs> what do you think about the NSA? It's Aww. not perfect. <laughs> the NSA is adorable. Lego was made out of acrylonitrile, butadiene, styrene. I looked this up because chemicals are my thing. And maybe I'm wrong about the video. Like, I, I haven't seen the whole thing, but it doesn't really offer an alternative, does it? No. It, it just says, like, like here are these bad things that are happening. Now don't. <laughs> don't do it. And then it just ends. 